Welcome everyone. Very good afternoon to all of you. We are here live from Bhubaneswar, from the Capital Arena, with an important match between Odisha and Meghalaya. It could very well prove to be as good as the finals. Here we see both the teams. So we have Meghalaya in white and Odisha in navy blue. It's going to be an exciting contest. And simultaneously we have another match. That's Sikkim versus Telangana, which also is a very crucial match in this group. That's the Odisha team. That's the Meghalaya team. Both the teams done with their team photos. Now captains will come for the toss. Both the captains and the match officials. Referee Irfan Sheikh and his assistant referees Rohit and Mohammed. Here we have the starting 11 for Meghalaya. We have jersey number one, Rajat Paul Linden. Jersey number two, Bang Slim Lang Mao Long. Jersey number three, Alan Camphor Lingdong. Jersey number six, Ronnie Wilson. Jersey number seven, Don Lad Denglo. Jersey number eight, Pin Balang Suting, Jersey number 11, Figo Sindai, Jersey number 15, Nicholson Bina, Jersey number 16, Full Moon Mukim, Jersey number 18, Van Boklong Linkoy, Jersey number 19, Dwangcha Carlos. We have a minute silence. The minute of silence was to commemorate the legendary footballer Pele. As you must be aware, he passed away. And the substitutes for Meghalaya, Henry Ford, uh, Abrong Kurba, Everton Brighton, Sun, Man Bakurpur, Iwak Pinhwa, And the starting 11 for Odisha, Chinmaya Shekhar, Pintu Samal, Srinath Sheikh, Shahbaz Alam, Adwin Turki, Arpan Lakra, Chandran Muduli, Sanjit Kora, SK Farid, Rakesh Oram, Prabin Tiga. Substitutes for Odisha, Chandra Karthik, Anand, Dibandu, Vikash, Rahul, Bijay. Olek Shankar, the Siddhanta, Urban, and Ankit.
and we await the referee to get us underway as i was mentioning earlier this is a very important match right now these are the top two teams in the group and also there is a match simultaneously that's going on that could decide this group so there we get underway odisha attacking the left goal post on our screens in navy blue and we have meghalaya attacking the right goal post on our screens <laughs> both these teams coming off a three goal margin win big wins will be high on confidence this is the 76th national championship senior men's called the famously known as the santosh trophy and odisha here from the word go are showing their attacking intent there you see again closing down quickly putting meghalaya under pressure meghalaya forced to play the long ball odisha pressing very well high up the field again you see them being forced long Oh, this our defense with the clearance there. No chances being taken. And Meghalaya building up, trying to settle their nerves early in the match. And winning a free kick here. quick free kick here taken and again they keeping the ball across coming in there but the header not troubling the goalkeeper now odisha starting short but then playing the ball long and ball now with meghalaya losing out there now odisha on the attack and a free kick to odisha and your you see meghalaya on the attack goalkeeper making a save and on the second attempt getting to it goalkeeper playing the ball long and now odisha trying to build up both these teams as i said have played well throughout this tournament and this is going to be a very very crucial match for both these teams both need a result
ऑफ साइड देर अगेंस्ट मेघालय this time odisha with the long kick and quite some distance there some good skill there on display so odisha in midfield Advin Turkey you see him jersey number 5 displaying some good skills there there again he's on the ball and a good one touch wouldn't say the same again well this is a tournament organized by all india football federation the governing body for football in india this group stage matches have been supported by the local odisha government odisha government has been supporting a lot of sports initiatives in the country and soon they'll be even hosting the hockey world cup they also were a part of the women's under 17 world cup as a host they are running into trouble trying to release the forward here But the Meghalaya defender did well. Making sure he got his body in between. Back book long. Good job there. This time a long ball from Meghalaya. now odisha calmly patiently building up long ball across defender gets to it meghalaya putting a ball behind the defense but that was more hopeful than precise and this time odisha playing the ball long defender doesn't make good contact with it opportunity here can they capitalize cross coming in or not no defender gets a leg in there corner here for odisha So the first corner here. Can Odisha make something of the set piece? We have six players in the penalty area. And it's going to be a left-footed delivery, by the looks of it. so it would be curling towards the goal and first pose there and the opportunity went begging what a flick there and should i put it on the back of the net
the first open chance of the game has not been converted and we are yet at 0 0. Sanjit Khura was so close to scoring that. An attempted cross by Meghalaya, lacking quality. Long throw down the line, well shielded. And Meghalaya keep the ball, opportunity to cross, this time it comes in, defender reads it. And cleared away eventually. Throw in for Meghalaya. Odisha almost won the ball back, but then taking no chances. And Meghalaya is building up well here. Offside there. Good build up. Had the player not been offside. And also good anticipation by the Odisha goalkeeper. But it comes down to nothing because it was offside. The Meghalaya player was offside. So it's an indirect free kick for Odisha. Meghalaya defender this time clearing. And Odisha playing the long ball, but that's out of play. This year's tournament, the Santosh Trophy has further significance because it's going to be played on foreign soil the final round what an opportunity and everyone would be looking to pounce on this opportunity and in this group these two teams are right now front runners and odisha are through Attempted cross, low cross, read by the defender. It was more towards the direction of the defender rather. Defenders had covered the angles well. But nonetheless, it's a corner for Odisha. Another opportunity. They got their first opportunity from a corner kick. Can they create another goal scoring opportunity from this set piece? Again, a left-footed delivery is going to come in, curling towards the goal. This time, not good quality, but however, they got the ball back. And was it a shot or a cross? A bit confusing there. So that sailed away out. Goalkeeper would be not troubled by seeing that shot and relieved as well. Throw in Meghalaya. There's been a lot of development since the new committee has come in all india football federation at the hem we have mr kalyan chobe who's the president now of the all india football federation 
a top goalkeeper of his time. And since coming into power, he's been doing a lot for Indian football. And one such initiative is taking the Santosh Trophy final round to foreign soil. Where we would have higher ranked countries at their venues will be playing the final round and an opportunity to have some foreign opponents as well in the final round. Long throw here on the left flank. Well, good build up here, but offside. And Sanjit Kora this time doing a good job, but then a bit too early with his run to receive the one two. And was judged offside. Free kick here for Meghalaya. But it's within their defensive third. Playing the ball back to their goalkeeper. Goalkeeper playing it out long. Getting some good distance on it. Well, calmly dealt there by the defender. And now he's on the run. Spreads it out to the right winger. Who crosses the ball in. And the shot finally miscued, sailing over. Relief for the goalkeeper to see that going flying. Nowhere close to the goalpost. And now Meghala again build up. And here they have lost the ball. Odisha on the counter. Meghalaya getting bodies back quickly. Cross coming in. And another chance there. A bit too high for the player. This jump required a bit more height on that. Twice we have seen Odisha from across creating a goal scoring opportunity. However, it was not converted, but these are some good signs for Odisha. Odisha winning a free kick here. Long kick there. Defender gets a header on it. Meghalaya trying to keep the ball and 
Again losing out. Odisha will again try to attack quickly. Meghalaya defender intercepting. This time a good switch here. By Meghalaya. Now Odisha building up. And there you see again in the midfield how calmly Turkey keeps the ball. Advin Turkey. Odisha defender winning the header and Trying to build an attack from the right, but the Meghalaya defenders outnumbering them and winning the ball. And Odisha again on the attack. Played out to the right wing, cross coming in, blocked by the defender. Another corner here for Odisha. We are halfway through almost the first half. And another left-footed corner there. Again, not getting past the first defender. Free kick, Meghalaya. Quick start there. This could be a counter here. Good ball played through the center. Has got it again. Finally, Odisha getting it away. Classic counter attack there. However, failing to convert from that, did everything right there. And Odisha putting bodies in the way to make sure that Meghalaya did not score on that counter. The right back did a good job there to keep the ball. And now we see Meghalaya penetrating into the attacking third. A good one too there. The left flank cross coming in. And almost scoring over there. Goalkeeper being forced to save. Corner kick. Meghalaya. What a move it was from the left flank and what a cross and attempt. This will be calling away from the goalkeeper. And there's a ping pong of headers going on in there. Ball comes out to the left flank. Goalkeeper gets a touch to it. Meghalaya players were at, were asking for a penalty. Referee said nothing doing. Play on. Dangerous cross there from just outside the penalty area. Another corner this side, this time from the right side.
another left footed delivery by the looks of it so this would be curling towards goal and it was direct on goal but the goalkeeper alert and these corner kicks in this match are proving to be very dangerous And here we see a free kick here to Odisha. Pressure relieved. Not a great free kick. Not a great clearance as well from Odisha. All of a sudden, you can see Meghalaya on the attack. And some good com combination play every now and then, especially on that left flank. Winning the ball back, but judged to be a foul. Free kick Odisha. Odisha building up again. And ball on the right flank. Attempted cross into the defender defender manages to clear to his own player and now then combining free kick megalia The, the Odisha defender calmly dealing with the ball played behind the defense. As you see, most of the game is being played on the far side. For anyone that has just joined us, this is the 76th Hero National Football Championships. Famously known as the Santosh Trophy. We are live here from Bhubaneswar. The capital arena and this is your host Furman D'Souza bring to you live action between Meghalaya and Odisha a crucial group stage match both these teams on top of the table and equal on points with the second position we have another match going on simultaneously so both these matches very crucial you could say kind of do or die matches
two thirds of the first half done with. Throw in Meghalaya. This tournament is organized by All India Football Federation. This group specifically has been supported this group stage or this group has been supported by the Odisha government and FAO, that's FAO, that's Football Association of Odisha. And the hopeful ball there, goalkeeper will easily collect it and Meghala will again build up. As I was mentioning some time back, that we have a new committee, new elected committee at All India Football Federation, headed by the President Kalyan Chobe. top goalkeeper of his time and certainly since he's been president he's been doing a lot for Indian football and one such initiative by him is the final round of the Santosh Trophy will be played on foreign soil what an opportunity. And we are moving into the last 10 minutes of regulation time. Both these teams would want to make sure that they do not concede as well if they can take a goal advantage into the halftime break. Megale again with the ball and Patiently building up. Long ball there played towards the left flank. But Odisha with the ball now. And there is an opportunity to cross. Cross coming in. But Meghalaya defender reading it well. 
And a long distance shot that will not trouble the goalkeeper. Yeah, you see the replay. Goal kick Meghalaya. And Meghalaya again building from the left side. As I said, both the teams have played most of the game on the far side. Meghalaya's left flank and Odisha's right flank. Both the teams have had most of their attacks developing from that end. And here you see another cross coming in, but not going to trouble the goalkeeper, not going to trouble the defenders. Goal kick Odessa. And now Odessa build up patiently. Calm and composed. And a good wall pass there. And a through ball put, but defender reads it. But under pressure, has to clear, throw in Odessa. Looks like a long throw in coming there. And defender again reads it. Attempted cross, but Megalia get the ball. And Megalia can counter now. Good ball played to the center out. To the left wing, asking for a penalty, but referee says nothing doing. Play on. Throw in Odessa. Here we have Meghalaya again on the attack from the left side. Attempted cross, but ball is back with Meghalaya. And it goes out for a goal kick at the end. Required a better cross. And Odisha trying to thread a through ball there. But it easily fell to the goalkeeper. And Meghalaya again on the attack. This time the defender will get to the ball first. Throw in Meghalaya.
Megale again, calm and composed. Cross coming in. Defender gets his head to the ball, but the ball is yet with Megalia. Trying to combine. Wanting a free kick there at the edge of the box. And we have the Odisha player through, but Megalia defender reading that ball again. Play has been stopped. As I was saying, this is a very crucial match for this group. We have Meghalaya on 10 points, Odisha on 9 points, Telangana on 9 points, and Sikkim on 7 points. And we have two matches being played simultaneously. And anyone could end up topping this table at the end of these two matches which are being played simultaneously. That's how crucial these two matches are. And here we have Meghalaya versus Odisha being brought live to you. We are into the dying minutes of the first half. Referee will get his underway with a drop ball. And we are live again. This broadcast is brought to you by Sports KPI. And Sports KPI is broadcasting a lot of matches across the country in football and here Megale with a chance and that's the opener right in the dying minutes but the referee has given offside assistant referee has given offside that goal won't count Lifeline there for Odisha. As I was telling you, this podcast is brought to you by Sports KPI. One of the top broadcasters in the country in terms of sports. An altercation there. And a few minutes back, we almost thought we had the opening goal of the game. It was a brilliant move, unfortunately, for Meghalaya. Striker went in a bit early and was offside. And Meghalaya with the long ball. Corner kick. The best opportunities of this game 
has come through the corner kicks. And we are past the regulation time. There will be three minutes of added time. Minimum of three minutes. Another left-footed delivery here. And that's the opening goal. Meghalaya have got one right at the death of the first half. But that's a fumble by the goalkeeper. The left-footed delivery gets the ball to curl towards the goal. As mentioned earlier. And this time, that working in Meghalaya's favour. What a time. What a time to get a goal. And notice on the attack now. Ball put through to the center. Goalkeeper comes. Penalty. Sudden panic there. In the mega layer defense. No communication and we see now Odisha having the opportunity to equalize from this penalty. Camera one, thoda chodo. And we have Prabhin Tiga of Odisha stepping up for this penalty. And he scores! Sensational end to this first half we are having. Two goals in added time already. Thrilling stuff here. One all. And that's half time. What a first half we have had. Seem like Meghalaya was going to go with a goal lead into the halftime break. But Odisha with a reply quickly winning a penalty and equalizing. What a match. There's the halftime score and Confirmation of the score. Meghalaya 1, Odisha 1. This broadcast is brought to you by Sports KPI, by Football Association of Odisha. This group where we have the stats here of the first half. And we have Meghalaya with 49% possession compared to Odisha's 51. In, in the beginning, we saw Odisha dominating and... As the half went on, Meghalaya 
settled their nerves and got into the match. This broadcast and stats are powered by Sports KPI. Here's the points table. As mentioned earlier, Meghalaya is leading with 10 points and Odisha has 9 points and Telangana with 9 points as well. But Odisha has a better goal difference. Sikkim with 7 points and both these matches, Meghalaya versus Odisha and Telangana versus Sikkim are being played simultaneously. Looking at this points table, you could clearly say how crucial this match is. This is group five being played in Odisha. There's a confirmation of the score with the goal scorers. Alan Campbell in scoring, scoring for Meghalaya. And Prabin Tigga from the spot for Odisha. Both the goals came in added time of the first half. The score of the other match going on. This is that is Telangana versus Sikkim. That's 0 0 right now.
Welcome back. This is Furman D'Souza on behalf of Sports KPI, the broadcasters. Here we bring to you the points table again. And we are going to get the second half live action underway of Meghalaya versus Odisha. A sensational, thrilling end. To the first half, where in added time both the teams managed to score. Here we are underway, and Meghala and White are going to be attacking the goal post on the left of our screens, and Odisha in navy blue will be attacking the goal post on the right of our screens. And Odisha here winning the ball. Trying to build an attack from the left flank. Keeping the ball well. Under pressure. But finally, a touch too much there. Losing the ball and giving away a free kick to Meghalaya. Meghalaya now with the ball. Long ball from the goalkeeper. And that rolled out for a corner kick. Goalkeeper tried to scramble and avoid a corner kick but it does go out for a corner kick and we have seen how dangerous the corner kicks have been in this match almost every corner kick has provided the teams with goal scoring opportunities this time playing it short cross coming in Meghale defender having to clear the ball And another corner kick here. Left footed delivery, so it will curl towards the goal. Ball is yet in the penalty area. Goalkeeper coming out. Megale defender clearing, but ball comes back to Odisha again. Played out to the right wing. The cross. This rolls out for goal kick. Pressure relieved for Meghalaya there. And a long ball from Meghalaya. Odisha take control of the ball. Goalkeeper playing a long ball this time. The Odisha striker controlled that well on his chest for his teammate. And a cross coming in here, but in no man's land. Goal kick, Meghalaya.
goalkeeper's laces being tied by his teammate. And now Meghalaya taking a long goal kick. Odisha defender doing well under pressure there, being calm, composed, and eventually winning a free kick. Long ball there by Srinath. Meghale player there dribbling onto the left flank. They've had most of their attacks coming from the left flank in the first half. And a chance here. Ball is yet with Meghale. Short. Not going to trouble the goalkeeper. One bounce into his midriff. And even lacked the sting in it. So an easy collection for the goalkeeper. And now Odisha have the ball. Building up patiently. Not forcing the issue. Well, lose the ball there and Meghale on the attack now. Ball played into the center. Meghale player comes and gets it. Meghalaya yet with the ball, now on to the right flank. Short blocked there by the defender. Played out to the left flank now. Attempted cross, hits the defender, corner kick. This time Meghalaya with the corner kick. Again, a left-footed delivery, so this will call away from the goalpost. Meghalaya player has the ball in the penalty area. Cross coming in there, offside. Odisha defenders doing well to step up at the right time. Throw in here for Meghalaya. And the second half, both the teams have got spells of possession. But now Meghalaya with more intent as it seems. And the shot totally miscued. Goal kick, Odisha. The host for this group. This football association of Odisha. And as we spoke in the first half and half time, this is an absolutely crucial match for both these teams. They both are on top of the table and the third and fourth place team here 
an opportunity there but goalkeeper coming out coming together there let's hope both the players are fine and as we mentioned earlier this match very crucial for both the teams first and second place of this group both playing here and the third and fourth place which are not far behind in terms of points are playing simultaneously the score at half time there was 0 0 telangana versus sikkim both players seem to be fine and they are under way this our midfielder was continuously under pressure that will be a free kick and this time the oldest our players have a good opportunity to launch the ball into the penalty area referee has asked to wait for the whistle and free kick launched into the penalty area and it required a save from the goalkeeper corner kick odisha in this game all the set pieces have proved to be very dangerous that's the confirmation of the yellow card duancha carlos chalam from meghalaya this time the corner kick didn't prove to be dangerous and meghalaya trying to build an attack now winning a throw in and some space for the meghalaya player cross coming in from the left flank odisha defender heads it out and now odisha have the ball and a long ball played striker gets to it and the striker takes a shot and that's a goal what a move that was what a counter attack let's have a look at it again some great skill there to make some space for himself and what a shot no chance for the goalkeeper there brilliantly done
Chandra Muduli for Odisha. Taking the lead. Score is 2-1 now in favor of Odisha. Meghalaya now are surely going to throw the kitchen sink at Odisha because this match is very crucial for them. And this is going to make it really exciting. Goal kick, Odisha. What a counter-attack. What a ball that was put to the striker. There were three Meghalaya defenders. But a precision long ball. Making sure the striker got to the ball. And then the striker with some pristine skill to make some space. And get an amazing shot away. That's the confirmation of the goal for Odisha Chandra Muduli. This live broadcast and stats brought to you by Sports KPI. And after scoring the goal, Chandra Muduli took off his jersey and got a yellow card as well. That's the confirmation. No one knows this match's importance that he was so ecstatic and took off his jersey, but hopefully it doesn't prove too costly for Odisha. Free kick Odisha here. Long ball played. Go out for a goal kick. Throw in your forward is up. High up the pitch. That's where they would want to be. Long throw here. Looking at the run up. And that's a throw put into almost the goal area. However, the header. Going out, goal kick Meghalaya. And now Meghalaya on the attack. Rike Kodesaya. Can see Meghalaya want to desperately win the ball back. But sometimes in those attempts. Substitution here for Meghalaya. Jersey number 10, Karthik Hantal. Sorry. Jersey number 10, Mangbakpur. Coming in. You can see there's the confirmation of the substitution. Mangbakpur coming in for Figo Sindai. Seems like another long throw for Odisha. 
Ball again. Almost reaching there. And finally the snapshot hitting the side netting on the outside of the goal post. Let's see the replay. Towing the ball and inches wide of the goal post. Well, advantage played over here. Meghalaya with the free kick in the opponent's half. Twenty five minutes of regulation time left in this half. Launching the ball into the penalty area. Ball goes up high, goalkeeper comes for it and gets it comfortably. And the long ball again, very precise. Can't say the same about the first touch of the striker this time. You can see quite an intense match. Both these teams are trying to attack. Mother throw in Odessa. Well, this time it's another position for a throw-in, which Odessa enjoys. Trabin Tigga. With another long throw there launched into the goal area. And this time the Meghalaya defenders able to clear their lines and eventually win a throw in. Free kick there for Meghalaya. Some good combination play, but finally a bit of miscommunication among the players of Meghalaya. Ending up at the ball, rolling out of play for a throw in for Odessa. A shot attempted from far out.
Short went sailing in no man's land, nowhere close to the goal post. There's a, for some time there was a head of ping pong there. Now you can see some physical tussles developing there. The Meghalaya players asking for a penalty. Referee stood firm. He said, goal kick. Play has been stopped as the referee's attention was required at the sidelines. And you see a yellow card shown to one of the officials of the Meghalaya team. It's a must-win match for both these teams. You will see the passion, the intensity among the players and the officials. Goalkeeper is going to keep that ball. They're leading by two goals to one. Trying to run the clock down. Long ball played there. And was in control there. So throw in for Meghalaya. Free kick Meghalaya. The Odisha defenders alert, not allowing them to take a quick free kick. But now, Meghalaya with an opportunity to launch the ball into the penalty area and create some panic and goal scoring opportunities inside that penalty area. Odisha defender getting his head to it and Meghalaya have a throw in now. Some good combination play there on the right flank for Meghalaya. Even though it's crowded, they're keeping hold of the ball. A cross coming in. Acrobatic effort. Doesn't connect. Meghalaya get the ball back. And now a free kick in a very important position. And a yellow card there for the Odisha player. But more importantly, what a position to get a free kick from. This is certainly a goal scoring opportunity for them. Can they make the most of it? (laughs) 
What a delightful position for a free kick. You can either try a direct free kick or even float it for one of your players to get a touch. Four man wall set there by the goalkeeper. Tries a direct one, but no sting. But the goalkeeper fumbles it. Corner kick, Meghalaya. Right footed delivery will curl towards the goal. Throw in here for Meghalaya. That's the confirmation of some time back. The Odisha player Arpan Lakra getting the yellow card. Being cautioned. And giving away the free kick. It, that didn't come to a lot. Resulted in a corner kick. And now we have another corner kick here. Well, Meghalaya building the pressure as we move into the last 15 minutes of regulation time. Ball curled towards the goal, but dealt with. And then finally, Odisha clearing their lines out for a throw in for Meghalaya. Odisha goalkeeper goes down. receive some treatment now the goalkeeper is the only player who is allowed to receive treatment on the field the other players are generally to be taken out and treated but not in the case of the goalkeeper Judged to be a foul throw there, very short throw taken. And their throw in expert comes to take the ball. There's a score update. Sikkim is leading by three goals to nil against Telangana. Odisha have another chance here. And the header going out wide. What an opportunity this was. Certain goal scoring opportunity. Keeps Meghalaya yet in the hunt for the equalizer. Substitution here. For Meghalaya. Ever bright sun coming in for Meghalaya. Starting to see some tired legs now, cramps. As we move into the last few minutes of the match, about 11 and a half minutes to be precise of regulation time, and then we'll have added time. There's the confirmation of the substitution. Ever bright sun, Sana comes in. For Ping Balang shooting. Oh, 
and the ball is given straight away to the odisha player goalkeeper comes out clears good interception there by the goalkeeper that mistake by the defender could prove to be could have proved to be very very costly but the goalkeeper read it and saved the day and the throw in weapon of odisha prabhin tiga always on the ball as soon as there's a throw in he's seen his throws are like rocket launchers causing a lot of trouble every time he throws especially in the attacking third the broadcasters of this match sports kpi and the host for this group number 5 is football association of odisha the ball launched in there but directly into the defender of odisha this time meghalaya player shown caution do you shown the yellow card as i was mentioning the broadcasting and stats partner sports kpi live action here from odisha where we have the table toppers meghalaya and odisha fighting it out here and as of right now odisha leading 2-1 and if things stay this way odisha will go to the top of the table but in football you never know especially this match has been an example where we had two goals in added time good ball there for the forward showing some skills there but then losing out that's the confirmation of the yellow card to the mega layer player alan camper sliding tackle there by the odisha defender on the ball clean and square and the tackle and mega le with the ball dribbling past three players there and now a good pass they yet have the ball cleared away by odisha but ball is yet with meghalaya and odisha have got the ball this could be a dangerous counter attack a long distance shot not troubling the goalkeeper and meghalaya have the ball again the 
We move into the last six minutes of regulation time. Meghalaya launching the ball. The Odisha defender heads it. And now, long ball played behind the defense, but the player is offside. Meghalaya again building up. And see, they're desperate to score. Cross coming in there. Ball has been kept in. Another cross coming in. Onto the right flank. Another cross there. And a corner kick. Meghalaya piling up the pressure. And a double substitution here for Odisha. That's the confirmation of the substitution. Sanjit Kora is out and Dina Bandhu Das comes in. And that header required a save from the goalkeeper. Let's have a look at it again. What a header and what a reaction save there. Pressure piling up here. Meghalaya is Piling the pressure on Odisha. And we are back underway. Ball headed into the penalty area. Goalkeeper comes, punches. Odisha player gets it. Meghalaya again has got the ball. Odisha player clears. And off the Meghalaya player for a goal kick. Caution shown there to the goalkeeper. Yellow card shown there to the goalkeeper. Caution for time wasting. Two minutes of regulation time to go. Meghalaya, you're running out of time. Trying to dribble, but not able to get through. But the clearance by Odisha gives the ball back to Meghalaya.
long by ball by the goalkeeper went straight to a midfielder of odisha and under pressure had to give a throw in to odisha again last 30 seconds of regulation time and odisha has thrown in weapon rabin tigga also scored from the penalty spot in added time in the first half there he comes with his long throw in into the goal area goalkeeper punches odisha yet have the ball cross coming in offside and to add a time now and there shall be 9 minutes of added time yet a lot of time to be played and the ball launched by the goalkeeper but odisha defender getting ahead to it and now the meghalaya meghalaya desperately trying to penetrate into the attacking third have been failing now for the last few minutes and there you see their throw in weapon again rabin tigga and meghalaya now on the attack but the ball played behind the defender will get to it first and he takes no chances clears the ball out throw in meghalaya and ball put into the penalty area there and that's a goal another goal in added time let's have a look at it goalkeeper came didn't get hold of the ball another at a time goal as i was mentioning some time back in this match specially you can't say when what would happen and meghalaya have got the equalizer in the dying minutes of the second half and now both these teams will push for a winner in the remaining 6 minutes of added time minimum of 6 minutes of added time that is to be played and as per the stats for to you by sports kpi meghalaya just need a draw to go through so this works in their favor so odisha need to score and that ball played down the line was asking too much of the odisha right back
match a stop for the player to receive treatment we are into the added time halfway through of the added time shown by the fourth official that's 9 minutes of added time there's the confirmation of the goal scorer ever bright sun sana from meghalaya what a time what a time to get that equalizer and if that equalizer means meghalaya is going through well there could be no better time to get it but they yet have some time in this match and as i said earlier anything can happen it's not yet over shouldn't get over confident and believe it's over meghalaya on the attack a ball played through or is our defender clears meghalaya have the ball again good skill to get through there keeping the ball now at the corner flag gets past the player and goes back to the corner flag and wins a corner kick the final score from the other match is sikkim 3 telangana 0 broadcasting and stats partner sports kpi bringing to you the live score update from the other match as well a long hopeful ball played defender heading it and the goalkeeper gets it right now anywhere will do for meghalaya and Right now, they even have the possession of the ball, and they would want to keep it and run down this clock. Free kick here for Meghalaya. launching the ball again into the penalty area headed by the meghalaya player but into the hands of the goalkeeper odisha now on the attack from the left flank meghalaya defender getting there just in time but odisha has the ball again it's not yet over and a shot with a sting needed a save look at that had some swerve with some curl needed a save and a corner kick odisha can odisha do anything with this ball launched in there nobody gets a touch to it meghalaya will be absolutely relieved to see that ball go out of play
Goal kick here taken long by the mega leg goalkeeper. And that is full time. Meghalaya through and in what fashion getting a goal in added time and also the result of the other game going in their favour which meant a draw was enough for them to go through What an end to the match. Final score, two all. That's the goal scorers for both the teams. And you can see three of the goals have been scored in added time. Allen and Evan Brighton son for Meghalaya and Prabin and Chandra for Odisha. Your other full time stats powered by Sports KPI for you. Odisha had more of the possession here, 58% possession, 58 possession. However, you see the shots on goal, 7 on target, 7 shots on target compared to the 3 of Odisha. In total, 12 shots by Meghalaya and 6 by Odisha. Nine corners also won there by Meghalaya compared to the seven of Odisha. You can see in terms of the scoring intent, Meghalaya clearly wanting to score. And that intent gave them the equalizer in added time. And this is Furman D'Souza on behalf of the broadcasting and stats partner Sports KPI signing off. Have a great day. Thank you everyone for watching. Take care.